Hi there. Welcome to my channel. I am Rinki and I thank all my subscribers and my viewers for all their support. The past year has been a difficult one for me and as a result I have not been able to put out as many videos as I would love to. Even though my artwork keeps me really busy, I promise that I will post videos as and when I can. So send me your recipe requests and your questions too. I love to answer them myself and interact with you. So thank you once again for all the support. We are making cherry tomato and cottage cheese pasta today. One of the easiest pasta recipes ever. It's a total comfort food that is enjoyed by all and it's perfect for the season. You'll be able to cook it in 15 minutes time. Did you subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon for the latest updates? While the water for the pasta is boiling, I'll just quickly take you through the ingredients. I'm going to use some chili flakes, red chili flakes, half teaspoon, dried basil, half teaspoon, dried oregano, half teaspoon, and I'll use one tablespoon of chopped garlic, a handful of mint or basil, uh, this is fresh mint that I am using today. Cherry tomatoes. This is about 2 cups of cherry tomatoes. About 50 to 75 grams of paneer. Good quality extra virgin olive oil for cooking. Some processed cheese or parmesan if you have to grate on top. Salt and freshly cracked pepper. 200 to 250 grams of penne pasta season the water with salt and add in the pasta now while that is cooking let's start with the sauce Add in about 3 tablespoons of extra virgin olive oil. Let it heat up. In goes the chopped garlic. You could add more if you want. Cook it on low heat. Till the raw smell goes away. Once the garlic is lightly colored, add in the cherry tomatoes. Season it with a bit of salt. The salt will help the tomatoes to cook. And some freshly cracked black pepper. Toss it up. Cook it on low to medium heat till the tomatoes are cooked and they burst open. Let's check on the pasta. This should take about 10 minutes as per the packet instruction and I'll keep it al dente. All that sizzle is because of the tomatoes bursting open. Can you see? I just help them by squishing them with the back of my ladle. So this is now cooking for about uh, 3 minutes. Time to toss in the chili and the dried herbs. And in the meanwhile, I drained the pasta and reserved some of the water which I will just add a bit of. Once that comes to the boil, add in the pasta.
Toss it up. Check and adjust the seasoning. If you like the recipe, share it with your friends and write your feedback in the comments. Some mint leaves. Crushed paneer. You could add ricotta if you have. Toss it up. And turn off the heat. Serve it immediately. Grated cheese on top. Some dried herbs. Some fresh mint or basil leaves. And that's ready to serve. Serve it hot and enjoy.